All the rain we are getting is aggravating the damage that was already there, leaving potholes. It's going to be a tough job to fix them all. Marley, it's the story that we can't ignore. Tell us more about the rain that we're expecting this weekend. Yes, so as we've seen for a few weeks now, there is a ton of rain and we are expecting rain totals up to six inches and the National Weather Service has issued a flood watch for LA County through tomorrow morning. Plus, as we know, Malibu is at high risk of mud and rock slides like we saw during last week's storms. The city of Malibu suggests that residents in flood vulnerable, vulnerable areas, which is most of the city, subscribe to the city's emergency alert system. Sandbags are available to all residents and can be picked up from any LA County fire department. Taking a look at today's total so far, Malibu is seeing heavy rain with about 0.2 inches so far. We have a high of 59 and a low of 54. Humidity was as high as 100%. It's about 92 right now and winds were very high up to 15 miles per hour and we're seeing about 12 miles per hour now. As the storm picks up tonight, we could see gusts as intense as 20 miles per hour. Around our area, Santa Monica had a high of 58 and a low of 54. They are also braving the storm with a 100% chance of rain. Through the canyon, Calabasas had similar temperatures today with a high of 58 and a low of 50. But drivers should be cautious driving through the canyon with the storm conditions. Thousand Oaks and Agora Hills both saw similar highs of 58 and lows of around 52 with precipitation amounts between 1 to 2 inches. Thanks to all of this rain, the fire risk today is low. And for our surfers, the waves are low today between one and two feet, but bacteria levels in Malibu waters are high due to the rain. So postpone any beach plans for an, at least 72 hours until after the storm passes. The chance of rain will remain at 100% with precipitation amounts between two and four inches and up to six inches in the Santa Monica Mountains until tomorrow when rain is predicted to taper off and clear out around 11 a.m. It will continue to remain cloudy as we move into the night with a high of 61 and a low of around 50. In more exciting news, some clearer skies are expected for Thursday with a high of around 60 and a low of 50. We'll see similar temperatures on Friday with some sun peeking in. As for the weekend, Saturday will be a tad warmer, but there is a chance of rain after 11 p.m. As for Sunday, the temperatures will also be a bit higher, but the chance of rain will last during the day as well. Well, thank you for that update, Marley. Uh, it's a bummer to hear that there's more rain. Ruins my surfing plans. I know. <laughs> you think spring semester, summer's coming, like I'm going to the beach, but I haven't been able to go to the beach at all this March. I know. I can't believe the sun hasn't come out yet. Hopefully soon. <laughs> Fingers crossed. Yeah. Well, thanks again, Marley. Thank you.